Tom Loy with Blue and Gold Illustrated here with Providence Catholic four-star wide receiver tight end Miles Boykin. Miles, uh, talk a little bit about your recruitment right now. Who's been coming after you the hardest over the last month or so? Uh, you know, first off, it's been blessed just to be in this position, but um, Illinois, Michigan State, Ohio State, Michigan, and Notre Dame. Talk a little bit about Notre Dame. Uh, you, you talked about being up there pretty soon. When's the next time you're going to be on campus? Uh, the 14th. Down there with Core Six. What are you looking to get at, gain out of that trip? Uh, you know, just to get closer to some of the players down there. You know, meet a lot more of the coaches and the players. You've been there a bunch of times. Uh, what's what's their recruiting pitch to you now? Why are they making you a priority, and why do they want you? I mean, I think, I think they just want me to do good things on the outside. You know, they offer me as a receiver, so you know, I was pretty happy about that. But they think I just have the size and speed to throw off most DBs. Which coach on the staff are you the closest with at this point? Uh, coach Dunbrock. And talk about, you know, with him being the offensive coordinator now, and you know, obviously he's firsthand going to tell you how he's going to use you, um, how do they plan on completely using you a little bit more in detail? Uh, you know, we haven't really gone into too much detail about that, but, you know, we just talked about some of the positions, like Corey Robinson, he sees me as okay. like that. But, uh, you know, he's been to my school twice now, you know, we talk all the time. How close have you guys gotten throughout the process? I mean, is he a guy that you can just talk less about recruiting now and just talk about, you know, life, school, things like that? Yeah, usually we don't talk about recruiting, we usually just talk about, you know, the school or anything else besides football. What is it about Notre Dame that kind of has always been, has always caught your eye and, and been appealing to you? Definitely the academics and just the tradition they have, you know, you always play on TV every game. And then who are some of the other schools in the mix? I know Michigan State's right there, right? Um, Illinois, yeah, Michigan, they have, you know, Michigan State's got some of the nicest facilities in the country. Talk about Michigan State a little bit. Uh, Michigan State is just nice, you know, for a receiver, I think they have a great opportunity for me. They're not going to have many there as soon as I get there. So hopefully, you know, they try to pitch me that you know, I'm going to have an opportunity to play early. Is that one of your factors that you want to kind of get on the field as a freshman? Okay. And then um, when are you planning on making a final decision? Any idea? Uh, hopefully August. Yeah, we'll see. But hopefully August. You're trying to get out of the way before your senior season? Yeah. Okay. And then are you going to be doing any more camps over the next few months, or are you kind of done working out? I think the only camp I might be going to is uh, Illinois Friday Night Light Camp. Okay. And you were thinking about going to the Irish Invasion Camp uh, at Notre Dame on June 20th, but you have a basketball camp, I believe? Yeah, okay. So uh, other than getting to Notre Dame again, getting to Illinois, do you have any other trips planned before you make a decision? Oh, Virginia Tech. I'm, I'm excited about Virginia Tech. I, I can't wait till I get out there. You know, I've heard great things about it. Have you narrowed your recruitment down to a, a top five or so? Do you do you have a kind of a group of finalists in mind? Uh, no, I'll make my top ten in a weeks and then for those uh, the recruiting fans that haven't you know don't take the time to watch film things like that kind of break down your film a little bit as, a, as, as an offensive weapon uh, I think I just, I'm a big receiver not afraid to block anybody and uh, can go up and make big plays and what, what's the biggest area you're trying to work on and, and improve heading into your senior, senior season right, right. I think a receiver is going to always be better at route running I'm just right. trying to finalize that alright well again this is Tom Lou with Miles Boykin Miles thanks for your time buddy thank you